Hello students, how are you all? Our today's subject is English and in English today I am going to teach you how to write G, how to write capital G and how to write small g. So here G for G for crabs, G for crabs. Okay. So firstly we will learn how to write capital G. So firstly we will learn how to trace. To write capital G, we will first make a curve. Okay, like this. Firstly draw a curve and then draw a small sleeping line and one standing line. Like this. Okay. Firstly draw a curve and then small sleeping line and a standing line like this draw a curve and then draw a small sleeping line and a standing line now after tracing you have to write with these two dots firstly draw a curve like this okay and then stop here and then Draw a small sleeping line and then a standing line. Make a curve first and then small sleeping line and a standing line. Firstly draw a curve and then small sleeping line and a standing line. Make a curve first and then a sleeping line, small sleeping line and then a standing line. Like this. Firstly, draw a curve and then a small sleeping line and a standing line. So children, you have to li write like this in your copy and practice it daily. Now we will learn how to write small g. This is small g. Okay. And to write g. Firstly. Do a curve line. And then we will do a straight line. Down and curve it at the bottom. Like this. Firstly. Do a curve line. And then we will do a straight line down. And curve it at the bottom firstly do a curve line and then we will do a straight line down and then curve it at the bottom like this okay now we will write g with these two dots firstly do a curve line and then Draw a straight light down and then curve it to the bottom like this. Firstly, do a curve line and then straight light down and then curve it at the bottom. Okay. Firstly, do a curve line and then do a straight line down and then curve it to the bottom. A curve line firstly and then we will do a straight line down and then curve it to the bottom firstly do a curve line and then do a straight line down and then curve it to the bottom like this so you have to practice this at your home and write this in your